Hi Aquarius, thank you for being here with me today you guys. Let's look at your tarot cards and see what messages come through for you today. Spirits, what does Aquarius need to know? Could be dealing with the Leo, you have the sun coming up, and you have the three of cups. Something about a child here and someone's energy. But I'm seeing you're going to be very happy here because I'm seeing you celebrating something maybe out in the community or going to a little get together or something maybe with your children but I'm seeing you there's something here that you're going to be celebrating all right and then the tower is coming down so let me see what's going on you have the king of wands here The Knight of Pentacles, the Page of Wands, the Six of Cups, the Queen of Pentacles, Justice, Libra Energy, the Five of Swords. And the Empress Taurus Energy. Someone here got, this is just a specific message for someone watching right now. They got into a huge argument, a huge conflict with the Taurus. Um, or someone who has Taurus in their chart. There, There's like the energy here of a mother and a child also. Of an argument showing up here. Tell me why the sun is here. Tell me about the sun. Okay, so you have the Knight of Wands, the Queen of Swords, and the Knight of Cups. There's someone coming up right behind you here, Taurus. And this energy of this person coming up behind you, this is an X. All right, this Queen of Swords. And do not pay attention to the gender, but this person's going to take some type of action towards you. We all have free will, but this person's um, right now, they, they want to do this. I can tell you that. They want to come up behind you. And the funny part is, is you've got someone else here in your life that you're kind of disgusted with. You have this Knight of Wands, which might be a younger person. But there's someone here that you're holding up your sword to, and you could be just about ready to cut this person off. This is someone that um, could act very immature. Tell me why the Three of Cups is here, but there's someone in your energy showing up, Aquarius. Someone that you have, there is a block in communication right now. There's no communication with this person. Why is the Three of Cups here? You have the Emperor, Aries energy, and you have the Ace of Cups. You've, you've got someone here... In your energy right now that um, I'm feeling like this could be a older person this could be someone that you're married to but there's someone here that likes to be in control and this person I'm seeing there's an argument that's going to happen or a conflict even though this person runs around and acts childish they're very stubborn they think they're the boss but you do have something showing up as new love here. 
and it shows up as new love because there's been an ending to this connection. It's someone in your past that is thinking about you and wants to come back into your life. Yeah, the Ten of Cups is here. They want to have it all with you. When this person arrives in your life, they're not going to want to move slow. They're going to want it like, I'm home type of energy. I'm home. I love you. I Their sincere energy that they're showing me here, and this may be a water sign, a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio, but it doesn't have to be. This person sincerely wants to have it all with you Aquarius whoever this person is but I'm seeing a tower happening here something that you're not expecting Ooh, okay here they come this person they might be a Capricorn the devil is here this is a past energy and it's going to shock you you know this person could have walked away and now they're turning around and coming back around again that's why this just flipped out of my hand in reverse tell me more about the tower this person could be getting their way back into your life you know because i feel like they want to show up nonchalantly this is someone i told you this message may not get to you because this is someone who is full of ego, full of pride, and so they're going to want to show up nonchalantly. This person, they might actually be moving into the area where you live or something and accidentally run into you. Tell me why the King of Wands is here. Yeah, see, they're in hermit mode, Virgo energy. You... This person's been quiet. You haven't heard from them. But this person has learned a big lesson. All right. They're showing up here as the hermit. Like they've been through the dark night of the soul. The two of pentacles. This person. This person has done some damage though. All right. And so that's why they're like this, going back and forth. And in their, in their pride and in their ego about coming in and speaking to you here. Because look at what they're going to run into. The Ten of Swords and the Seven of Swords. This person betrayed you. They lied, cheated, or stole from you. They did, they did a lot of damage here. But I'm seeing someone here moving towards you. This is a very fast energy. And so is the Knight of Swords. Like rushing towards you very quickly. Tell me why the Knight of Pentacles is here. Yeah, the Four of Wands. You've got someone else here in your energy though, Aquarius. And you have the Eight of Pentacles. This could be a marriage. But in this connection, you know, this person, you're trying to work on it, but this person leaves you like this, where you may have sleepless nights. There's a lot of worry here. And like I said, you could be just about ready to, to cut this person off because it's like you're at your wit's end. Tell me why the Page of Wands is here. The person currently in your life, you're at your wit's end with this person. But the past is trying to come back up behind you. And you don't see it coming. Tell me why the Page of Wands is here. Death. Scorpio energy. And the Page of Pentacles. And the Nine of Wands. Yeah, this person wants to come to you. They're confused, though. This is someone who wants to apologize, who 
how things ended. This could be a Scorpio with the death card showing up here. Um, you could, someone has two children with this person, but the, the way they're showing up here is they show up as the wounded warrior. So this is someone who has experienced karma, karma for what they've done to you, but they keep thinking about you. Tell me why the six of cups is here. Yeah, see, look at look at what they want. They they want to give you it all. This person seriously has learned a huge lesson, and I don't know exactly what this person did. It's showing me betrayals. It's showing me that this person deceived you in some way. And we all have free will, but this person is really really thinking about you a lot right now the five of wands is here this person wants to fight for this there's other people that don't want the two of you to come together this could be a cancer with the chariot but i see like movement like someone here this person could physically be moving towards you like if you lived in a different state state than this person <coughs> <coughs> sorry Aquarius why is the queen of pentacles here I feel like right now you're in energy here where you're focused on your you know like you might be working on your house or something for the holidays there's something very stable here in your energy that you're working on. But you are having a conflict with someone else in your life right now. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here? This is the past. Trying to come back into your life judgment raising something from the dead tell me why there's two queens why is there two queens okay that makes sense. You could have someone else here in your life with you, like a child that's showing up. This person, they might be a Leo. Tell me more about this person. Why is strength here? This other person in your life, this person is very, very, um, they have, this is a specific message for you, for someone, but this person has very clearly, and this might be a child, has very clearly had discussions with you about this person, and they're very much in their emotions about this person, and they do not they do not want this person coming back into your life i can see that right here they don't want to, the two of you together see that's what stands in between the two of you that lion energy justice why is justice here so i'm feeling like this this person is going to be a great temptation to you to come back into your life. But Seven of Cups. But you're going to have to make a choice here. Yeah, see a choice that you don't want to make. The Two of Swords on the bottom of the deck. This is a choice that you do not want to make. 
You have two loves. Even though this past person did, whoever this reading's for, even though this past person did you wrong in some way, it's been forgiven. Why is the Five of Swords here? You could be this mother. Take what resonates and leave the rest. Because for some of you, this person that doesn't want you with this other person, this could be a child. Tell me why the Five of Swords is here. It's something where you're keeping it a secret, but you really do want this person to come back again, but you're keeping it a secret. You're not saying anything. You're staying closed off. You don't want to admit it. Tell me why the Empress is here. Ten of Wands and the King of Swords. You've got someone else here in your life right now that you're trying to make a decision about. Seriously, this is a king. Seriously trying to make a decision about whether you want to carry around these burdens that this person puts on your back. So you already feel like this. So you could be feeling very weak when this past energy returns. And so this judgment of yours, this decision of yours, it's showing up as you being like, I'm not going to tell anybody when this person shows up and when you talk to them, when this conversation takes place. This is a tempting, this is a temptation. I love you guys. I will see you next time, Aquarius. Namaste.